Hi everyone, welcome to JavaScript 30 days of lead code challenge. Now today we are having in a problem 2724 which is sort by logic. Now if you check it here, they are giving an array and they are giving in a function fn and it returns a sorted array sorted arr. So basically they are asking us to sort the array uh, you know uh, using the function. Now here you can assume the function only returns numbers and those numbers determine the sorted order of sorted order, sorted array. So the sorted array must be uh, ascending into the ascending order by function output. So you should pass each and every value to the function. The function will return the element. Based on the function returning the element, you should sort the elements one by one by one. And there is a default method which is called sort in the array. Let's see how it will works and let's also see more and more here. Now here, if you have an array, two comma, three comma, five, and you can directly write this particular array, two comma, three comma, five, and you can say it like sort, which will sort the element lexographically. Uh, basically means, for example, here, if three comma, 33, uh, 33, and five comma, uh, 15 is there now according to the javascript this sorting method it will check it on the first one and it will print it like in the new array first one is 15 why because the first one which contains the first digit the two is containing first digit two three is containing first digit three 33 is containing first digit three five is containing first digit five and 15 is containing first digit one so it will consider it as okay this one is containing the one so it will be the first one in case if you are applying at the default sort instead I don't want to apply the default sort you can take an array I'm returning return arr dot sort and instead of directly sorting it now here if you take two values which are a comma b here and then that means indirectly you are taking two values into the array and after taking them you can give here an expression the expression which can able to uh, make them swap now imagine the function is returning a particular value now here you can able to sort with a logic like every time two numbers will be compared imagine you have an array one two three four five uh, it's like imagine it's not it's a no, not in sorted order five three two kind of first five will be compared with the next digit and then in case in case if it is less than then uh, you you can sort it how it will work first i will do five minus three if i get the positive digit if i get the positive number five should go after the three if i get it the negative digit then three should go first and uh, you know uh, it's like if, if I get it 5 minus 3 th that is a positive value in that case 5 will be after 3 imagine 1 is there 1 comma 3 that is a negative uh, that is a negative 1 minus 3 so I will keep the 1 in the same place I will not change it this process will be applied for every other elements if you repeat the same process here it works similarly a function applied for a will be subtracted from a function which be applied for b now every time the consecutive numbers will be checked and in case if the first number is greater than the second number what will happen when you subtract you will get a positive whenever you get the positive the first digit will go to the right set imagine you get the negative that means the first number is less than the second number then the first number will be staying left side of the second number as it is now this will make it the whole array sorted out let's go here yeah there it is which is of 38 milliseconds now you can check it on having a brainstorm with a simple example of an array and check it on how it will works in case if you get it any more doubts you can always contact us and you can check it on our more programs in our playlist thank you all